Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Destroy All Humans. All right, we left off. We had uh, done a little bit of uh, shenanigans around Rockwell, if I remember right. And then I uh, went to Santa Modesta to continue those shenanigans with the Majestic. Now, uh, we're going to continue on in Santa Modesta as a uh, ten card will remind me in a second. <laughs> Foreign Correspondent. put a dent into Majestic's mind control efforts, but they won't stay down for long. However, if we can harness the massive power of television... We could oh. brainwash the whole country. We can easily transmit our signal on normal television frequencies. All we require is a suitable guise, a persona the humans will trust. My really? My research indicates one possibility. A human television presenter called Bert Wither. But he's made himself hmm. scarce. Perhaps he got wind of what you did to Sleepy Ernst. Forgive Maybe. Impertinence, but you are an alien, are you not? How'd you uh. guess? I knew it. I knew it. My prayers have been answered on behalf of all really? the nations of the Earth. I welcome you to our planet, oh friend from another world. Gee, thanks. All right. Enough chit chat. We need now that I realize he's wearing tin foil, <laughs> it makes sense. You want Bert Wither? You got him. Follow me. Wow! I didn't even need to convince him or nothing. Perfect. Okay. Bert Wither assassination scare. Oh, I was in the mid yawn while I was saying that. An assassination scare. Why? Why do they think there's an assassination attempt? Weird. Safety fears cause American news icon to run to ground. Says the news cannot be silenced. Well, I mean, it's gonna be silenced. It's just gonna be. It's not gonna be silenced. I don't know if I said that right. I'm a little sleepy and I don't have my coffee. So uh, <laughs> this is gonna be fun today. Uh, it's not going to be silence, but it is going to be a little changed from the uh, normal news. All right. Well. Please come with me. No majestic awareness, huh? All right. That's right, big man. There's oh boy. Oh, yeah. Nothing keep... special. Sure just my baseball cards, my bottle cap collection, my notes on eleven-dimensional super string theory. But don't tell anybody, okay? Please scan me. I won't go on unless you scan me. Okay. What? Great. Imagine if you disguised yourself as Burt Wither. They wouldn't know who to shoot. Man, that'd be keen. He, <laughs> it's rich. Okay. That's weird. You've got electric force fields around the perimeter. You can turn them off, though. Just shoot the machine. Okay. Please scan me. I won't go on unless you scan me. You can take a human form, can't ya? You can get over there in disguise. Only one disguise will do, though. Okay, well. Then I don't know what disguise you want me to be taking. Find out, I guess. Bert Wither is being held under the old lighthouse. You better stay low. They have gun turrets around the perimeter, too. A whole ton of them on the water side. Okay. Watch out for the EMP mines. They've got a bunch of those around the perimeter, too. Oh, I've already run into those. pretty rough, actually. The perimeter is extremely rough from the sound of it. Uh, I'm assuming that's for the island over here. What, what the... Was I supposed to keep following him? I was. Okay. Well, shit. Boy, do I love Burt Wither. Even though he called me a crackpot in that TV interview, he said lukewarm fusion would never work, but it would, and I know it. If only I'd gotten the funny, but I didn't, thanks to Burt Wither. Bastard. Okay, so he does not like Burt Wither. Okay. Hey, look at this diner takes food to Burt Wither. He 
She's the only one who gets past the force field and the guards. Huh. If that crackpot scientist is correct, Bert Wither is under heavy guard. And only this cook is allowed near him. You should use this cook to reach Bert Wither. Oh, that isn't some nice tack to avoid having intrusive other people's thoughts. <laughs> Alright, uh, Hypno, that's what it looks like. I'll wait right here for you, Master. Okay. Good to know. I'll just disguise myself as a cook, too. Maybe that'll help. Those stinking guards with their stupid questions. Obviously, I'm there to deliver food to Bert Wither. What the hell else would I be doing there? Um. I, clearly, they think something else. It sure is weird. Bert Wither all holed up in a damp cave. There's got to be a funny story there. There's probably an innuendo there somewhere. I'm just not knowledgeable enough about 50s slang to, uh, <laughs> to know one way or another. Those stinking guards with their stupid questions. Obviously, I'm there to deliver food to Bert Wither. What the hell else would I be doing there? Well, I mean, you're right. There isn't a lot. Oh, Jesus. Okay. All right. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Oh, man. Buddy. Walking past all those gun turrets scares the crap out of me. Yeah, me too. Lucky I brought a change of pants. Yeah, lucky for you. What about me, though? Where's my change of pants? Sure is weird. Bert Wither all holed up in a damp cave. There's got to be a funny story there. Hey, Carmine, how you doing? Making another delivery, huh? You're a hard worker. Yeah, this is Carmine, the cook. I got a food delivery for Bert Wither. You want to turn off the force field? You know, Carmine, you look like death warmed over. What did I tell you about eating your own cooking? <laughs> I, 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 oh, hold on a second. I'll let you in. All like, right. So smart guy. What? Is your name? Um. Oh. Well. He's dead now. Alrighty. Please don't hurt me. I'll do anything you say. I, I wasn't care. planning on hurting you. Get your ass, you will. Come on, birdie boy. I got a little job for you. If it's a decent job i'm sure he's gonna Attention, do it an alien freak give yourself up you are completely surrounded am you i have 10 seconds to lay down your weapons and hypnotize yourself into a coma ready on 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 hot damn fire okay well they're having... they're hitting each other it's great <laughs> Edgy. Day. Technically, we don't know gender yet. Wait, wait. Yes, we do. I remember now. There was a mention of that. There was a mention of that in a uh, couple episodes ago. <laughs> episodes? Episodes ago. That's what I was trying to say. For fuck's sake. Well, you're dead. And whoop. You're away. Oh, geez. Okay, well, uh, that's not gonna work unless I blow it up with this. Good! Alright. And that's probably gonna be the same with this. Alrighty. And we'll PK that. Ooh! Oh, and it destroyed the turret too! You're going out of business. Get Don't make. Man, this is actually kind of working out. Yeah. How do you avoid that, jackass? <laughs> Alright. Put me down. Oh yeah, I'll put you down. Just over there. 
<laughs> Alright. Woo! Alright, this is actually kind of fun. <laughs> About you go over there. Into the drink! <laughs> Alrighty. Don't make me call Hoover. Well, it'd be hard to call him from the ocean. And Making sure there's nothing else other than this thing. For some reason it's showing that there's something over here, but I'm not seeing it. Anyway. So, get rid of that. And... Let's get him moving to the saucer. This city's getting way too crowded. A million people is just too many. It'd be great if something just came along and just swept them away with, say, a, a superheated death ray. Well... <laughs> Ain't that a ringing endorsement of my actions, eh? <laughs> Alright, well... Uh... Okay. I wonder if Doris Day is really as innocent as she looks. Bet she's a wildcat. Okay. Janet better not give me any lip when I get home. I'm in no mood. Well, unfortunately for you, you're probably gonna get some lip. Okay, so everyone's losing their shit over. Strange occurrences reported. Patrols ordered to keep an eye out for The only strange occurrence is he's out in the open. Me now. Yeah, sure. This feeling like someone's listening to my every thought. I just can't shake it. Well, uh, in contact, there's a reason. It's a okay. Keep in contact with Bert Wither. Well, I don't have any fucking concentration. It, it is hard. Keep up the strange sightings have continued. Extra units have been sent to investigate. There's nothing. How about no? Hmm. What if you cooked hamburgers really fast and gave them to people in cars through a window? Nah, that's a dumb idea. It'd never work. <laughs> sure. Yeah, it's a real dumb idea. That I indulge in every other week. <laughs> Wither threatens to leave news desk over salary dispute. Alrighty. I'm assuming the SMCBS is uh, the broadcasting station for Santa Modesta. I'm assuming. I don't know. Autosave. And because I have enough DNA to last me the rest of the game, probably, I don't think I'll need to uh, worry about that for a while. Okay. Let's get out of here. And there we go. I was going to say I was going to cause some havoc, but uh, now I'm thinking I don't need to. Just going to return to the mothership. Get a drink of my coffee, give me a bit. Did I say coffee? I meant soda. Because I'm still out of coffee. That's how sleepy I am. I'm mistaking soda for coffee. And it's not even soda that has caffeine. Fuck my life. Alright. Mission available. New upgrade. Let's look at the upgrade, shall we? So what would you like to upgrade, you little ball of unbridled aggression? Well, uh, let's Just see what you, what you got. Need. A bigger gun. 
Uh, well, yeah, exactly. You could learn to better utilize your abilities. Well, you don't have anything for that, so Steps that doesn't help us. Excellent choice. Ooh. souped up ride. Really, Arthur Pox? Really? Okay. Increased ammo and area of effect for the sonic boom. Right. Fuck yeah. You sold me. The upgrade is yours. Well, I mean... Step right up. Weapons, abilities, saucers. Upgrades are us. <laughs> okay, then. Cool. Um... <laughs> More Santa Modesta stuff. N believe me, folks. It's, it's not a lot of variation until near the end game. <laughs> so... I mean, the areas are massive, don't get me wrong, but... You're going to see a lot of same names until about last third of the game. So, just buckle up for that. Anyway, Suburb of the Damned. Let's see how this will go. Apparently, not well for the people of the Suburb. The success of the broadcast depends on you, Crypto. Does it? You must protect those towering transmission towers! Each Move. tower has a transmitter at its base. If the army want to stop the broadcast, they'll have to take out those transmitters first. Alrighty. I guess I'll have to defend the thing. Which is easier than an escort mission, honestly. Quite frankly, I was expecting the escort mission with Burt Wither to go wrong didn't go wrong but because of that I'm expecting this one to go wrong <laughs> alrighty address nation at 6 p.m. remain tight-lipped over content of news special who is this guy oh And gets an individually uh, different face than everyone else, so uh, he's important. Regiments two and four form up the main junction. One and three take the flank. I am Attack pretty wave. sure we shouldn't have been able to see that. I got those comp towers out of commission. <laughs> Your task is simple: destroy the communist insurgents holding the. Where they just phase through the fucking Don't army truck. Vodka swilling Trotsky eyed son of a bitch is gonna hijack this great nation's god given airways. Not on my watch. They weren't given by God, but okay. And I'm not Russian. <laughs> okay. Extra patrols have been sent to investigate. Well, SMCS will bring you further news as it unfolds. Uh, okay. Well, this is Bert Wither coming to you live from pretty easily SMCS. for now. Studio, America's closed location in America's sunshine capital, Santa Modesta, with a special news bulletin. For years, America has been a beacon of hope to the world. But when it comes to Whoa. Whoa. Proof, our very way of life is under attack. A great nation devoured from within by a malignant tumor of corruption. Okay. Yes, you heard it here first. The very heart of power in the United States Jeez. of America is now cancerous. It's a as a a night, but well, I mean... I'm working on it. So much zero. fucking debris that I keep focusing on that when I go to is grab shit. Back. Your moment has a Ready and in position. Oh, you're dead. There we go. Fuck you. Oh! Oh! Okay, well, that works. Okay. Well, I don't know why you... I'm aware. I'm aware. Believe me, I'm well aware of this. Ooh. I get you. I'm also trying to... Get over there as fast as possible. Luckily, the damage they cause is rather insignificant. Tank. 
Although it's going to get really annoying. Then he's just going to keep talking about it. Oh, fuck you. I'm not going to let you tank. Fuck up. Oh boy. Fuck up all the progress I've made thus far. Screw that. Oh. Yeah, sure. Okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. Wild monkey taking down. Decomposing body stinks up Santa Motes to suburbs. Okay. Woo, wow. That mission is a little harder than I thought. Um, 139, ready for duty. Okay, that's two deaths. <laughs> that's two deaths. Oh, joy. Okay. Alright, I'm going to have to come up with a better game plan at this point because uh, the tools I have are... Uh... Well, I mean, I do have the ion detonator, but... I, that one has such little ammo, I don't want to use it as much. But I might have to, to be able to keep up. And that mission takes a long time, too, so... Take a lot longer than I have time allotted for. So, unfortunately, I think I'm going to have to end today's episode for now uh, on a failure. Because, fuck... <laughs> There's not a lot of time that I have no, left. Should be out destroying humans right now instead of twiddling your thumbs. Okay, Pox, how about we shut you up? Um, don't have a lot of time to redo that, and uh, quite frankly, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna have to come up with a whole new game plan when it comes to that to deal with all of that shit. So. For now, we end the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games. And, uh... <laughs> really off my game because I don't have coffee. But, uh... We managed to get at least one mission done right. Which is usually the hard one and i knew that i was going to screw up this one so i mean hey at least this was expected by me for you <laughs>